What is going on people? It is your boy Daddy Mac and welcome back to a brand new Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battle. We are against Dukes, Duke City, um, who's bringing a really cool team. The Zoroark is probably the Pokemon that's going to start right off the bat. I got a feeling I need a cup. <coughs> Talking too fast, I apologize. So we got Dukes bringing Zoroark, bringing up Frostlass, bringing the, uh, that's not Samurai, that's a Swampert. Um, he might even start with Swampert. Oh, that Dragapult. That brings back memories and memories that I do not want to recall. If you guys missed that video, that was the first uh, battle with this team. You guys should go check it out. Now, who do I believe he's going to start with? Zorak is a little bit tricky. I really want to start Zapdos. Although I probably don't outspeed. We're going to start Zapdos regardless. We should be able to take a, a hit or two from Zorak. We're going to U-turn first turn anyways. Part of the reason why I want to start the Zapdos. Um, really quick, I know that on my previous video, I discussed that my Zapdos kind of should have had a... Um, at least I think I mentioned this, I don't remember. But should have had a Choice Band. But Choice Bandit Taurus, that boy is just too dope to not have... Um, to not have, uh, what, what's the word I'm looking for? You had a Nidoqueen? I did not see a Nidoqueen in your team. Um, but as I was saying, Choice Banditarus, that boy is just way too good. Way, way too good. All right, so here comes the Nidoqueen, or Nido, Nidoqueen. We're just gonna U-turn right off the bat. That's what we're gonna do. Hopefully it's a Zoroark. It's not. This is straight up Nidoqueen. Um, probably a special attacker at that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring in the Gastrodon. And we're just gonna try to threaten this thing with the skull. We're gonna threaten it to switch out. You can switch out to whatever. You're gonna take a skull. That's that's the bottom line. All right, what you gonna do? Ice beam. Woo! I am kind of glad I didn't switch to something else. All right. PokemonGen.com. The shiny Nidoqueen Queen is about to go down. Well, I kind of want a scald, but he has one, two, three, four special attackers in the team. So it's kind of not worth in a way. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna Ice Beam right off the bat. I think that's a little bit better than Scalding because if he goes, I mean Swampert will get hindered within the flip turn, but I feel a little bit more comfortable going out into um, the Gastrodon and hitting the Ice Beam just in case he wants to be smart or try to outsmart me and then come into the Dragapult. So there is that. Um, oh, come on, bring in that, bring in the Dragapult. Swamper. Okay, that's what I figured he'd go into. It's the smarter play, to be honest. Um, I'm gonna stay in Gastrodon, and the reason behind that is because yes, he's probably gonna take the time to set up the, um, the what's it called? This the Stealth Rocks. But at least I'm gonna recover here. Oh, you're going straight up Earthquake. You don't care. You do not care. I'm glad I recovered. I am glad I recovered. Um. So he's probably running Protect and Flip Turn and Self Rock as his other three moves. So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to take the opportunity to Scald. Hopefully I can live an attack. Come on, Earthquake. Oh, okay. I thought he was going to hit the Self Rock for a second, but obviously not true. Um, Scald Burn. That's the only thing I can hope for. Come on, Burn. Yes! Okay. That's what I needed there. Um, not that I can take another Earthquake, but I'd really want to preserve the Gastrodon, mostly because... Why do I want to preserve Gastrodon? Ice Beam, Ice Beam, Ice Beam, Ice Beam. What can I take a hit from, though? Not really much, so we're gonna try to live. We have to try to live some kind of attack here, and, uh, recover it up. Come on, come on, Gastrodon. I know you're a thick boy! No, he's not thick. Gastrodon, I'm sorry. I put a little too much faith in you. And you just couldn't get the job done. That's three Wi-Fi battles in a row. Okay. You already know. There's no Stealth Rocks here, my boys. Because you know what we're about to do? We're about to hit that Retaliate. I mean, Dragapult is a thing, yes. I am aware of that. But if he comes Dragapult, I'm going to switch out into my boy... Um, What's the boy I'm going to switch out into? Durant. That's what I'm going to do. Oh, look at this animation right here. Swampert ain't got nothing on us. Okay, it's a crit. The crit didn't matter. It's a crit! I should be more excited about it, of course. So, that boy goes down. What did I do with my water bottle? I brought a water bottle just uh, for this very reason. So, because uh, if I record, I get really thirsty while I'm talking a lot. And um, 
I, dr I lost it, so this is my water from the last recording session. <laughs> I know the CMI, but you probably don't need to know that anyways, so. Frost Lash, he has two ghost types. I just forgot about that. Um, spikes maybe are a thing. I'm not too sure what Frost Lash wants to do to me. Because it can't really Shadow Ball, I'm immune to it. If he hits me with the ice type attack, then um, a Duran resists that, so. Nasty plot. I forgot that these things run nasty plot nowadays. I remember back in the Auras days, and I sound like an old man when I say this. Back when, um, I kind of want to crunch, bruh. No, that's a Zoroark. That has to be a Zoroark. Okay, so I'm going to exit her here. That's it. I knew it, boy. You do not outsmart me. You do not outsmart me. No way, Jose. All right, Zoroark goes down. Durant is still valuable to me because of the crunch. Crunch gets rid of his Frostlass, and it also gets rid of the other Pokemon. Who is it? Um, Dragapult. It does get rid of both of those Pokemon, so Durant is still valuable. Man, Durant's butt shaped like a bullet. Given that it's a bullet, and that's kind of cool. I bet y'all never noticed that. It looks like the tip of a bullet. The head, if you will. All right. What is my opponent going to go? I got to think two steps ahead. He's probably going to come out into Dragapult. If he goes Dragapult, then I go... Jeez, I don't think I got any switch ins for Dragapult. That's nerve. That's uh, nerve-wrecking. Okay. That's a smart play. And I knew he was going to go into Dragapult. I should have been prepared. Uh, I don't want him to set up a Dragon Dance. That's for sure. That is for dang sure. Hmm. Do I need Salamence? I know that sounds ironic, but I do not think I need Salamence. So we're going to go ahead and just sack Sa uh, Salamence off in case he wants to go for... I got a feeling he's going to Flamethrower if he's special. If not, he's probably going to Dragon Dance. Come on. I do not want to see another Dragon Dancer. Okay. I'm cool with that. I'm not going to outspeed. I don't... I, by all means, I feel like I'm not going to outspeed. So here's what we're going to do. We're just going to Dragon Claw. That's it. Dragon Pulse. I knew it. I don't outspeed. No way I'm outspeeding. This, I hope this thing is not sashed. I really hope it's not sashed. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go back into my boy Durant, and I'm just going to crunch it up. I'm going to crunch it up. He does not outspeed me. I really hope that I can hit this crunch, though. Well, I'm going to hit it. I hope I can knock it out is what I'm trying to say here. Okay. Yes, no choice or no focus sash. Last time we got against a Dragapult, that boy had a focus sash and things t went like the table. You basically flip that. You flip it. You flip the table. The table's turn is what I'm trying to say. Okay, who is this? Back to the, um, the Nidto Queen, which I'm not afraid of. I am no way afraid of this thing. Um, what do you, flamethrower. I forget you packed the flamethrower, so you know what? I'm gonna mag motor it up here. I got the psychic. You don't got any more dragon type or um, not dragon, uh, dark type. So he, no, no need to worry about Zoroark. Earth power. Oh, he read me like a book. Mag motor. I'm sorry. My apologies. I know I messed it up for you, and I really am sorry. All right, Nino Queen is the bulkier of the two Nidos, so I'm gonna come back into Taru's. You're about to take a choice bandit attack unless you go into Frostlass, which I, I really hope you don't. I, I, should I make a read? You're going to go into Frostlass, aren't you? I think Frostlass is still... Okay, yeah, you are. So what I'm going to do... I'm going to Stone Edge here. Switch out of here. I know you want to switch. You want to switch out. This Needle Queen is one of your win cons. Oh, no. I should have just retaliated. I should have retaliated. It's a crit! Sludge wave. Okay. You know what I'm going to do then? Predict another sludge wave. I'm going to go into the bullet amp. We're going to go into the... You know what? Nickname Durant to bullet. I don't think that's very... Um, I don't think that's very creative. But it is to me, you know? Got to use a little bit of brain meats. There you go. There you go. And you know what I'm going to hit you with? I have no idea what I'm going to hit you with. Um... Iron Head. 
Yeah, Iron Head's the attack. And I still need the Durant, so I really hope this uh, that we knock it out here. Come on. Knock it out. Oh, we barely missed the knockout. No flamethrower on this Nidal Nidal Queen. So, Durant is my wing con, so I'm gonna knock this Nidal Queen out. What? Am I not hustle? I am hustle. Hmm. Hmm. I thought it was an attack boost to every turn, but I'm wrong. I'm obviously wrong. There you go. All right. So part of me does want to stay into Durant because I thought Hustle would lower my attack or will increase my attack every turn and lower my deep, my accuracy every turn. But maybe I'm thinking old days. I think I'm thinking old days. Um, so if I... I think we let Tarus go here. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go into Tarus. We're just gonna sack him off because I'm afraid of this thing being sashed. I really am. I do not want to um, hit it and then just go down after an attack because Durant is my wing con. Shadow Ball. Here we go. I didn't even mean to read that. I didn't. I really didn't. I'm gonna Stone Edge here. No, I don't think we're out speeding. No way we're out speeding a Frost Last. Smart. Smart play going for the protect. Very, very smart. This is a good battle. This is a very good battle. Okay. Come on. Hit it. My boy Taurus. And no focus that. So we could have picked up the sweep with the Durant. Okay. Now. Is this a Gigantamax Tatarine? I got a feeling it is. So part of me doesn't want to save Tarus. Part of me does want to save Tarus. Though, his retaliate is gonna hurt no matter what. Well, yeah, we're gonna. Sorry, Zapdos. I know my team is built around Zapdos, but I really don't feel like we need Zapdos right now. I really don't feel it. And he's Dynamaxing just like I figured. I am nervous. I am nervous. Do not get me wrong. Okay. This isn't a Gigantamax Hattery. So at least there's that. Okay. Come on. What are you going to hit me with? Do not maximize storm. It's, a, it's that. We're going down. Yeah, we're not taking that. Oh, no. Now I'm nervous. Now I'm very nervous. Um, what do I do? Um, what do I do? I'm gonna Tarus. Obviously, that's a better play. That's the only play, quite frankly. And then we're going to intimidate. Doesn't matter on this thing, obviously. But we are. What we are going to do is hit you with that retaliate. And I hope we get a crit. Come on, crit. That's not a crit though. We don't need crits. What are crits? What are those? What are those? I don't know what a crit is. No clue. And that's the battle. That's the battle. That's the battle there. Okay. Iron head. And that is game. That is game. We played very well. Very, very well. Come on, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Max card. He played it right. He played it right. I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do, right? Hatterene on Dynamaxes. So there is that. Oh my goodness. Come on, Iron Head. Iron Head. Come on, Durant. Durant is a really good Pokemon. I don't know why I've never... Okay, I thought I was going to miss for a second. I don't know why I've never used Durant before. Look at this. We won. I'm kind of surprised. That came down to the wire. Literally. You know who the thumbnail is going to be. MVP. MVP is Durant. He's going to be the thumbnail. But that's going to be it for today's video. Make sure that I'm taking your lead card. Make sure that you guys leave a like. That's all I'm going to ask for. If you want some more... Subscribe to my channel because you do not want to miss any of these Wi-Fi battles. As you just saw, these Wi-Fi battles get kind of good. 
they get pretty pretty good but leave a like subscribe if you want i'll see you guys next time peace